challenge. Uh, this one's level eight and we're doing it in JavaScript. Uh, so I'm starting a new JavaScript playlist. Um, so this one we are going to convert uh, a number to a reversed array of digits. Uh, so here we have a, uh, a number 35231 uh, and then we flip it uh, into an array. Um, so our first trick here is I think we want to turn this into uh, a string. Uh, and then we'll take that string and chop it up into characters. Uh, so let's say, for example, we've got, uh, you know, let in equal 10. Uh, let me zoom in here. Um, so I need to do like, we need a Python, or not Python, we need a JavaScript uh, number to string. All right, so number to string. Oh, okay. So I guess you just do uh, n to string. Okay, and then we want to reverse it. So uh, let's see, uh, JavaScript reverse, or actually first we take the string and then split, and we'll just split every character. So we'll do just an empty string in there. Uh, that gives me my array. Then we need to flip it and then turn all those numbers uh, back into um, back into integers. Or, so they're strings right now, we need to turn them into integers. So here we'll do, uh, I believe it's reverse. Yeah, so reverse, we'll flip them uh, and then we'll do a map. We'll take each, uh, this will take a function. So we'll do uh, in string and do uh, parse int and then pass in in string, okay? So we do that, we get our array of reverse numbers. So I started with the number 10, turned it into a string, split every character, reverse that, and then we map a function to turn it back into uh, numbers. Um, so what we'll do here, and actually with this one, I think I can get away with just calling parse int there. So I could have done this where uh, we just give it parse int. We just pass that function in and then it takes care of doing that for us. Actually, I guess that's not going to work. Um, huh. I'll be darned. Okay. So with that, in that case, then we'll just do it the way we had it before. Okay. So we'll say, uh, you know, const in string is in to string. And then you know we can have our array. So const in array is equal to in string split every character reverse, and then let's return that array, and we'll map uh, for each in string. We'll turn we'll call parse int on in string. And that should be enough to try this out. Let me close out the console here. All right, let's do an attempt and we'll do a full submission. Great job.